Welcome everyone to the witch's house. Now we're going to be doing a playthrough where we hopefully never die. That's the goal, to get through the whole entire game without ever saving or dying, hopefully. If we die, we're going to have to start all over, so we better not let that happen. Let's begin. She awakens, and here's the first cat. I'm not talking to Kitty ever again. Sorry, Kitty, if I talk to you, I will probably die. So anyways, though, we're going to go find something rusty and sharp. Take it. It's got the machete. That's okay. We're not going to even look at the save menu. I'm sorry, Kitty Cat. You serve me no purpose right now. Then we go in here into our item thing and use the machete. Yes, we want to cut the roses. Cut the roses. Burn the roses. Let the roses do whatever they please. <laughs> All right, that all looks fine and dandy, I guess. We the way is cleared and our machete breaks because they want to make it sure that we know we're not using a machete in this game. So running we go, running, 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 running. Through here we go. Thing's gonna break right on through. Okay, we're gonna go in here and obviously step on that red patch in the middle of nowhere. Now we're gonna skip over that and read this note. Come to my room. Bear walk backwards. Now, of course, we take the long way so we don't accidentally trigger that thing. We're not gonna ca talk to cats now. What we need to do is get ourselves a teddy bear. The teddy bear, I'm just gonna do everything I can as fast as I can. I'm, I'm afraid about the points. I think I'm gonna be able to be just fine not falling into the traps that are set around. It's the things that go stomp, stomp, stomp. I'm afraid they're going to kill me. I hate bear rest against the pile. Take the teddy bear. Take out the teddy bear. Like, you all know what I'm going to be afraid about when I put this teddy bear here. Well, first of all, the teddy bear needs to lose its limbs. Let's do that. I guess we're going to move this way. And move straight onto these scissors. That means that we can remove everything. A pair of scissors and lurk bends. We will not take them. What we need to do is go over here and use our teddy bear. Cut off the bear's limbs. Don't mind if we do. We're going to see if we can... I'm afraid. I am literally afraid for this first teddy bear. Got the teddy bear torso. Let me go this way. And bear paw. I'm already afraid. I'm already afraid. I have to arrive a run button. Oh boy. Things are getting cool. So here's my plan. Here's my plan. The teddy bear is going to come munch, crunch, crunch. Ah, uh, should I stay up here? Like, he, he appears when you go right here. Or right here, anywhere around this line. So when he appears, so should I go up or down? I should probably go down and go back and try to run that way. He, he's going to probably kill me. He is probably going to kill me. I don't see how I'm going to get by this without him killing me the first time. So if I die, if, it's okay. I can get to here pretty quickly, even if he kills me. Uh, so yes, you just saw the bear thing move closer to you. You feel like it wasn't there before. And the bear paw, of course. You guys ready for giant evil teddy bear? It's gonna go boom, 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 boom. All right, all right. Oh, <laughs> I'm afraid of this because I'm afraid it's gonna kill me. Even though it's off, so let me just do what I can. Here we go. Get the evil teddy bear away from me. Okay, okay. Evil teddy bear's not gonna go bum 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 until I go back through here. Oh, well that got rid of the teddy bear. I guess that works. I guess. Okay, that was easier than expected. Okay, let's see. Uh... Oh, here we go. Teddy bear limbs on the ground. We'll take the teddy bear limbs. All right, go this way. The door is open. That's cool game. That's cool. Do nothing because there's nothing to do there. We can move this out of the way, but we need a key. To get the key, we go over here. I'm just trying to remember everything right now in my head. Read this, blah, 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 blah. Don't read. And I'm going to go over here and give you the Tabor limbs, land over limbs. Oh, thank you. I was going to give a hand or two. He shows me appreciation, gives me the silver key. With that, I run back over here. I move this out of the way. Do not drink that. I didn't use the silver key, so. Please the sound, put the key in there. 
magically a turn turns black, which unlocks the door somewhere, which means that we can run this way. We see something run by there, faces fall over, as I said. Door opens. I'm using my tiredness to my advantage to get less creeped out to play things as well. Use my tiredness to my advantage. And then don't even talk to the cat. The cat the cat's wait, actually there's something I need to do in the spider room, first of all. I go over here, I'm gonna go over there, and I'm going to pick something out of this. Piece of rope, I'll take the piece of rope, got the piece of rope, then left in the barrel, then with that I go this way. Piece of ground in the middle will get me scared if I go in the middle. So that moves just barely, go up here. Ah, look at all those fantastically clad books. Guess I better make him, don't talk to him, because I know he wants rope. Ah, you've given me this, give her up, thank you, take this, we got the book of death. Let's read the book now this game, then of course we read the witch's house too, which gives us a clue. And the witch's house, now if I go up here, there's other books to read, including the funny story, which is the story about how a dog gets killed, blah blah blah. My memory about this is pretty good. So there we go. He thinks it's funny. We go over here, we read this. And you guys all saw the teddy bear peek his head out over there. That's okay, we'll look up over here. There's the teddy bear, now no longer. We see the arc shoot, suit of armor scramper itself away. We go in here. And now this thing's gonna be a bitch to run past two. But we're gonna have to do it. We're gonna go this way. Item. We put the book of death here. Book of death. Don't read. Put the book on the shelf. Place the book on the shelf. Now it's time for the next chasing thing to happen, so we might die here too. It's the chasing sequences like this that I'm scared about the most. Hurt. Here it comes, here it comes. There it is. Okay. Oh no, no! Ah, oh, hell. Okay, from the top, from the top. I'm gonna do this quickly so the story happens. We open up. Oh no, look, we're still awake. Oh, whatever. I've messed that up. I got too frozen up because I got I accidentally clicked at the wrong time. This might happen a few times. I'm I'm afraid now. So we're gonna go over here. We're gonna pick this up. Take it. We got that. That's cute. Uh, we're gonna run over here through the roses. Running through a batch of roses. We're gonna cut this. No, we're not gonna read our letter. Who cares about our father? We're gonna run away. No, no. And then we're gonna use a machete to cut the roses. So with all that cut and said and done. Let's see, machete breaks. That's okay, because we can run. Run, 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 run. Break through here. Normal. Now then, this time we don't step on the bloody patch in the middle of nowhere. We go over here, come to my room. That's cool. And Isis, I'm right now playing the witch's house. So we go through here. I'm trying to do a no-kill run right now. In other words, by no-kill, I mean no death, more so. Run through here, go like, hey look, teddy bear on this, take the teddy bear. That's cool. It's kind of like a speed run, kind of like, uh, just simply don't die. Not supposed to be a speed run, but oh, I forgot when you put the teddy bear over here. Just I want to see if I can get the best ending in the game, so... I'm going to see if I can do it right now before we finish off for the night. Now teddy bear cough limbs. That's cool. Cut off those teddy bear limbs. They lack it like that. We got the teddy bear torso. Ooh, teddy bear paw. That's not terrifying. Ah, oh, the candle's going out. Normal. We go over here. We put the teddy bear torso in here. We put it in the basket. Now we leave and we see that the thing edges towards us because it moved, definitely moved towards us. There's even the bear paw. Then we're like, nothing's going to stop us now. And then we go over here and don't get killed. Now teddy bear should be gone, which means that we can run away. Yay. And now we're all fine and dan- Oh, look, teddy bear limbs. Better pick those up. Take that. See, we, we did that a lot faster this time because we know what we're doing. We're going to run over this way. Go through the silver key thing that's over here. Hey, I heard you want teddy bear limbs. Then you have can have teddy bear limbs. Give it to him. He's all happy to have them, I guess. So then we run back. We push this chair over here. Woo! See how much faster you can do these games once you know what you're doing. Put the key in the soup. There we go. Wow. As I said, blabbing's not a bad thing. I think it's fun. Kitson probably fell asleep in this chair. It's a distinct possibility, as I said. Uh, it happens to people sometimes. I've fallen asleep in my chair before, so... The door open, which means we can run this way. We see a girl passing by, and then something passing by the window as well. We're gonna go over here, and we're gonna go get our first thing that we need. Okay, I'd be afraid, I would be alright with a two tour. Alright with what? Ah, uh, 